What's going on guys? So I wanted to do a quick video here on how to create and handle environment variables in our Express app. We've been building this Music Talk app and you'll notice that our database credentials are always showing. So let's replace those with environment variables. Now this may be hard to believe but there's actually an NPM package that we can use for this. <laughs> That's a joke. Of course there's an NPM package we can use for this. It's called Dot env and we can install that into our project by running npm install dot env thank you for coming to my TED talk and this is the root of our server project by the way our node and express backend we could also do this in our react app if we need environment variables there in our front end so I will clear that and now we can add a .env file in the root of our project. And then before I forget, we want to also add this into our git ignore file, which I still have to create. Because we don't want to put those environment variables into git or github. So git ignore. And we'll put our .env file in there. And we will also do our node modules, which you'll typically want to do so you're not adding other people's code into your version control. So we'll save that git ignore file and X out of that. And so let's see, we have host user password database. So do db host db user db password and db name grab this localhost there the user is root Grab the password. And then the name of our database. And save that. And then to use these environment variables in our Express app, we want to do without capital letters preferably require dot env and then dot config and now wherever we want to use those we can access our process dot env and the host what did we call that db host makes sense DB user process dot env DB password and then process.env db name save that and now we can just do a test run make sure our database is still connected correctly with these environment variables so I'll run node index.js server listening on port 8080 And then let's see. In this terminal, change directory into client, which is our React app. npm run start or npm start. Beautiful home page. Let's do a whatever username and password. 
for now. Welcomes the user to the profile page. So far looking good. Looks like it was entered into the database correctly. Go ahead and confirm real quick. So we have our music talk and tables and then users. I click settings and not the query all button. There we go. There is our test username and the hashed password, which we learned how to do in the previous video. So yeah, credentials are still working good. And that is how you make environment variables in your Express app. In future videos, we will let the user create posts. We will follow other users and see their posts and all kinds of stuff. So stay tuned. If you haven't already, make sure you like and subscribe, drop a comment and say what's up. And thank you very much for watching. I will catch you in the next one. Check it, check it.